Grown man business. Grown man business. It's Red Ghost Sports Talk. I'm your host, Red Ghost. All right, today, all right, third day wearing this hat. You see it. You see it. College football, baby. We've got to talk about some college football, man. we got a lot of good games coming up Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. Oh, man. You talking about some rivalries going on? It's the weekend for it. First, let me talk about this game right here coming up. And that's Florida against ranked number 11 uh, Florida against Georgia. <laughs> oh, man. When you talk, when you say that, that, them two teams there, you already know, man. They in Florida. So all the Georgia fans, they are traveling down there to tailgate, man. You know, I'm in Georgia, so I know about it, man. Everybody, they, this is like a, a ritual. You know, every year, you know, the... the the, the, the fans, they go out there and tailgate. It's going to be a beautiful thing out there, man. Uh, it's going to be a rivalry. You know, I don't like Florida, man, so I'm going to go for Georgia. I've never been a Georgia fan, but I will tell you this, man. Uh, next year, they got a young kid by the name of, well, matter of fact, Evander Holyfield's son. He's going to Georgia next year. And he is, I, I'm going to get some uh, footage on him, some highlights. And I'm going uh, to put it in the description so y'all can check this guy out. This kid right here is great. He is great. He's going to be a big, big force. He's a running back, and he's going to be doing uh, a lot of big things out there in Georgia. Keep an eye, an eye out on him, all right? Because this guy, I mean, in high school, he was averaging like 200 yards a game. You know, he was ranked like number one in Georgia, number one player in the country, top player in the country. You know what I'm saying? So that right, that's gonna be a good game, man. Keep an eye on this kid, and uh, I'm gonna go for Georgia. Uh, it's gonna be close. It's gonna be close. Uh, you know, I don't like Florida, so I can't go for them, man. But uh, I say it's gonna be 38-35 Georgia. Uh, we got another one. Uh, number, rank 14, Oklahoma against Kansas. That's gonna be a good one right there too. Uh, don't sleep on Kansas. But I like Oklahoma offense, man. Uh, they got a, a strong running game. Uh, they always have some good running backs, too. Uh, the quarterback, I like the quarterback, man. They will go deep. They will go for some deep passes, man. And the defense is pretty pretty decent, man. Uh, so I'm, I'm going to go for Oklahoma in that one. We got Oklahoma State. They rank number 12 against Texas Tech. That's going to be a good one. Texas Tech going to give them a good fight. Uh I feel some upsets coming up, man, but I don't think Texas, Texas Tech is going to do this one. I'm going to go for Oklahoma State. Now, Oregon State against ranked number 13, Utah. Now, this one, the upset, upset's going to come. I don't think – I'm not convinced with Utah. I'm not convinced. So, I think uh, Oregon State is going to upset them this weekend. Um, Utah, Utah, I'm not. I'm not convinced by them, man. They uh they look pretty good against Arizona State, but that was Arizona State, man. So, oh, we got another rivalry, USC against California. I like that one. That's gonna be a good one, man. I'm I'm gonna go for USC. They've been playing some good ball since the coach uh got fired or whatever. So I'm gonna go for USC on this one. Georgia Tech against Virginia. Now they beat Florida State last week. Now are they gonna keep up with this high? Are they gonna keep the this this confidence up and, and beat Virginia. It's gonna be a good one. I'm gonna go with Virginia. Still don't like Georgia Tech. All right, this is grown man business, baby. We talking about college football, and it's a lot of good games. Whoo, grown man business, baby. Grown man business.